Hi guys, quick video. Uh, I'm going to revisit a video I've done before, a while ago, and uh, it's about a bottle on a belt. Uh, it's just a new take on it, a little tip I've got for you. I'll show you what I've got here. Pan the camera down a bit here. Hope you can see that alright. There you go. I've got a series of bottles here. Now what I normally use is this sort of thing here. You can see it's just quite a small capacity, I don't really need it, but although I sometimes use the bigger one here, it's about a litre, isn't it? Uh, with a pull top on it, and then I just spray it onto my applicator or spray it on the glass, like with patio doors, something bigger, you know, because I still do some trad work, although I do water fed, but mostly just the tops only because I use a backpack. But um, what will often happen with these sort of things. If it's in your pouch, and if you've got a big pouch, I put my cloth, uh, silk cloth in with it as well. And sometimes when you pull the silk cloth out, it'll tip the bottle up, and this will leak into my pouch and it'll down my leg. Although I've uh, waterproofed my pouches, uh, that's another video. Um, the bigger one, I've got the pull tops on this, but very often, sometimes you go to uh, wet your applicator or wet the glass and you forget to pull the pull top up and it's all a bit awkward and then you'll forget to push it back in again and then it'll leak down your leg or whatever or it'll fall out in the vehicle, leak all over the vehicle I've had that a few times so I got to thinking I was using one of these um, squeezy bottles you can see there's a tomato ketchup one, it's still full so I can't wash this out and use it just yet um, and what these have is the um, self-sealing nozzle here so you can have it upside down and it won't leak out actually so what I did is I tried this, I put some water in it um, I could try that now actually let's just put a bit of water in it just to prove the point this one's a bit small capacity but it's all I had at the time Okay, but I, I can get on with this because I, I can, uh, that will last me a couple of hours probably, it depends on what work you've got. But um, now you'll notice that this one doesn't leak, you see, when it's upside down, that's brilliant. All you need to do is like squeeze it and it'll come out like a jet. However, you don't need this bit here. So what you do is just cut that off with the scissors. Hey presto, look at that, I like that. It's always ready to use as well as soon as you grab it. It doesn't matter which orientation it's in, your pouch, whatever. You're not going to get a wet leg, whatever. It falls out in the vehicle, wherever. It's not going to do any damage, wet the floors, carpets, whatever. So there's another tip for you. I really like that one. Um, here's a larger version, which um, I'm not going to use yet because there's still a load of uh, product in it yet. But uh, that's the same thing, but it's, um, it's quite a bit bigger as you can see if you want a bit more capacity. I don't know whether you can get larger versions of this, maybe if you look around it's pretty good but um, that's a little tip, one of my favourites actually. It works really well so that's, um, that's another job done. If you like that, give it a go. Job done.